Developing news now, less than 24 hours after we told you about a child's death near an elementary school, the Department of Public Works is now taking steps to make it safer. Yeah, in just a few hours, a crosswalk will be painted along 91st Street in Nora, giving one family a sense of closure and dozens of others a sigh of relief. RTV6's Ebony Monet is live in Nora tonight with the latest on this project, plus new details on the young boy killed while walking to tutoring. Ebony. Todd, we spoke to people in this neighborhood who tell me that they have actually been pushing for safety improvements for years. They say it's very much so needed. In fact, they say every day and night you can see children crossing 91st Street, coming from that apartment complex and heading to the school grounds and other locations. And that's why they are excited by news of a new crosswalk and stop sign. They only wish these additions would have been made before this young life was lost. It was last week that a Nora Elementary first grader was critically injured after he was hit by a car. Car. Police say he ran from his grandmother into 91st Street and he later died from his injuries. School leaders say six year old Dawi had a bright, contagious smile. He was part of the Burmese community. He was coming from English tutoring and heading home at the time of the accident. Nora is home to hundreds of refugees, many who receive after hours tutoring, including English, English lessons, rather, held at both Nora Elementary School and next door at Faith Church. We spoke to people, instructors at Faith Church, including Wee's former preschool teacher, and they tell us during the day, teachers at Nora Elementary School actually act as crossing guards, but at night, families heading to and from their homes are on their own without lighting, crosswalks, or even sidewalks. He was kind of quiet, kind of shy. He was little in stature, and he got along with everybody, and just he was, he was really a joy to be with. He was a really sweet kid. There are refugees here. They've come from um, sad situations, and to come here and be getting their feet on the ground and then having this happen is, is just really sad. So I'm, I'm really excited that there is going to be a crosswalk. DPW leaders say in order to fast track this project, they have issued an emergency order in Washington Township. Officials actually have to approve this crosswalk, and they say that this work can begin as early as tomorrow. Reporting live on the north side, Ebony Monet, RTV6.